The long line of cars spiraling through the parking lot. According to the company, those are Caniacs, that's what they call themselves, that got there before the crack of dawn and waited in their cars for hours to get their hands on some chicken fingers. Cation is the first Raising Cane's fried chicken in Oakland. It's What's up, fuckers? Well, we did it. We waited one hour in line for raising kahanes. Uh, I believe they're related to the Monones, uh, the uh, indi indi indigenous tribe of Oakland. They finally opened up their restaurant. Uh, so we, we've got our box combo here. We've got tenders, toast, fries, and coleslaw, secret sauce, lemonade, and cock. Okay, we're going to quickly try the drink. This is the cock. We're going to try it. Generic, generic coke. I'm gonna do the house made lemonade. That's pretty good lemonade. It's not too sour, sweet. All right, here's the chicken. Se mm -hmm. Secret sauce. Here we go. Okay. That's pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna try the chicken without the sauce. It's just a pretty good chicken tender. I don't taste much seasoning, it's just a breaded chicken tender. That's pretty good. Um, crinkle cup fries look pretty good. Let's go ahead and try one with the sauce. Crinkle cup fries, doesn't look like there's much seasoning on this either. Okay, I'm gonna try the toast. Okay, the toast is supposed to be really, really good. Whoa. Okay. So like, it doesn't look like there's much on it, but I taste lots of uh, strawberry. It's a pretty good taste. Um, so we were recommended to not try the coleslaw. However, that source is inaccurate. Coleslaw, it's like it's like KFC coleslaw. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I mean, this uh, this sauce. Um, it's a pretty interesting sauce. I like it. It's pretty good. Was this worth the wait? Maybe. I don't know. I'd wait thirty minutes for this. I waited an hour. Overall, I'd probably give this um, a Martin Luther King out of Junior. I think it was well worth the wait. I only had to bring a, um, a vest and, a, and a, a Glock with me. That's about it. Yeah, I'd probably rate this a solid 8.5 out of 10. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next uh, Chatterbait live stream. So guys, it's been about an hour and a half. And uh, I came back to eat some leftovers. It's uh, it's still it's still bussin'. Uh, it's still pretty good. Uh, the cane sauce is definitely, definitely MVP. Cane sauce really ties everything together. Uh, the bread is surprisingly very, very good. I really can't explain it. The bread doesn't look appetizing at all. It just looks like a piece of prison bread with fucking sesame seeds on it. But the bread is actually really good. So I would say the sauce and the bread are one of the top MVPs. Chicken by itself, which I already ate, is really good. Um, the crummy parts, the thick bread, you know, just the bread with no meat, that stuff is really good as well. Um, French fries, kind of take an L. Just because there's no unique seasoning, you know, like a Red Robin seasoning or something. Uh, fries are amazing when you dip them in the sauce. That's about it. Crinkle cut fries, nothing really special about them. I would say the only the only L thing about here, definitely French fries. But I'm still sipping on the lemonade. We got the gallon. Pretty good. All right, Josh, final thoughts on Cane's. What would you think about it? 
All right, so overall, um, I think it's pretty snazzy. Um, honestly, like, I don't think it's worth the wait, especially. <laughs> I didn't think it was worth all the way, you know, surrounded by black people. Like, I don't like that. I like being with my niggas only. Anyway, besides the fact that it's not worth the way, I think it's okay. You know, I, I do like that. It's a little bit of salt. A little bit of salt in it. The fries by themselves. Yeah. But with the little, the little sauce right here. Oh. No, it's good. And then with the chicken with the sauce, it's good too. Lemonade, best part about it, no cap. Overall, what would you rate this out of 10? Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, I'd probably give it like a very small eight. Small eight, barely an small eight. Small eight. All right, it gets two thumbs up though. All right, yeah. right on. Yeah, all right. A hand grenade? No, it's a portable speaker. <laughs>